Hi and welcome back. Here we're going to have a look at the uh, markers here, the marker buttons that are assigned to markers. Now I don't use markers, I don't know if you do, but I hardly ever use them. I don't know why. Uh, maybe I should. There's a reason for them. Well there is. I mean when people do studio recording and have a lot of vocal takes and stuff they use the markers. Well, I personally myself I don't use them. So anyway, um, what I'm going to do is show you how I what I did. Now I've got a list here if you go here, I've got a little list of what I've done and what I use uh, quite often. So, uh, for example, um, here I'm on this track here and I want to change the colours. I I just bring up the colour button quite often. I do that. That was something I, I was reaching for uh, quite a lot. And um, then the second one is cut section, which I'm going to change because I don't use that much, which is basically if I go like that and I want to cut that section, I just go, I just hit number two and it cuts it. Yeah. Um, I don't know why that opened up my thing because it goes to the channel, I think. Yeah. So anyway, so uh, I do I come out of there and go undo. So that's really cool. And um so uh, I'm going to change that and I've mapped out all the other ones as you can see uh, just get rid of the colours actually the colours if I bring up the colours right that comes off and on so that's really cool so join if I want to join something I can just uh, select that like that and then hit join which is number three join there you go and that's worked so come out go undo and there you have it so that's the sort of stuff that I was missing from the uh, SSL nucleus I had. And uh, I want to change this cut section here. I'm going to go into markers. That's the number two. But I've got a really large screen. So my files are over the side here to access. So you need to go to logic, key commands, edit assignments. Okay. So what I want to do is I want to change that to repeat cells and events. Okay. So I'm going to go to learn assignment. So I reassign that because I don't want to keep both on there because I do two things at the same time, which you can do. So come out of that. Now, um, I'm going to save that. Oh, yeah, save. I've got save here. <laughs> so I can save it here as well. Number five. Uh, I, I did it. So I can save that. Yeah, hit save. And um, so let me just repeat that. Uh, or let me try and do a repeat on that, see if that works. Uh, so there you go repeat and logic 11 doesn't crash so i can undo that quite easily yeah and then i can repeat say a section so if i go into so i select this here that section there right from that precise thing i can now repeat there you go so it repeats sections it repeats everything perfect that is really good so so yeah i'm um i'm really happy with that that i managed to change them and i will obviously i'm going to change this now uh and put repeat section repeat section here right and i've got that saved to a, a text file so i'm just copied this in to each of my sessions i can copy that in but i will know these i already know like five is save and uh, 10 is quit and stuff like that so now i've done that i've got to save it save and now i've got to quit okay so ready quit there you go all gone <laughs> so fantastic yeah really enjoyed that anyway i really enjoyed doing that and discovering that i could do that uh hope you enjoyed this video if you did like subscribe and i will see you soon ciao